Hello everyone, today we present you the components available to support a crown or a bridge that closes on the neck of the Prama implant. This solution for luting technique can be used only on Prama regular neck and long neck and in all diameters. This version of T-Basis has a 5mm high cementation cone both in the engaging version for single crowns and in not engaging version for bridges and multiple structures. In the engaging version, the T-base can close on the neck at 0.5mm and 1mm in case of a, of a Prama regular neck and also in a case of a Prama long neck. The not engaging version is only available with a 0.5 neck closure both in regular and long neck. These T-bases are sold without fixation screw. You can order the VM2-180 for cases with straight screw hole or the or the TPDH18L66 if you need to angle the screw channel. In this case, it's advisable to use the appropriate screwdriver which is not included in the surgical kit. Let's see an example of digital use of these components. I'm using Sweden Martinez Archiplane software, but obviously the libraries are also available in Exocad, 3Shape, Dental Wings, Hypsocad and Promo Designer. Once the libraries have been downloaded, you can import them into the Archiplan software or the software that you're using. In this case, we're going to choose the Sweden and Martina Prama TCIN library. In the second column, I will indicate the diameter of the implant, the millimeters of closure of the tie base on the neck of the implant, and the type of scan body that I'm using. In the third column, it is possible to select the degrees of the inclination of the screw channel, By making the crown transparent, we can see the minimum thickness that the software creates around the prosthetic component. The recommended minimum thickness depends on the material that we choose. For zirconium it is 0.5 mm, for resin-based materials as, such as PMMA, graphene, composites, it is as well 0.5 mm. For peak and metals, we can go down to 0.4 mm. It is possible to use your own personalized parameters, taking care to always respect the recommended minimum thickness. Obviously, it's not possible to change the space for cement between the tie base and the crown because it's imposed by the library. Once the modeling has been completed, it's possible to mill the structure in-house if you have a milling machine or to send the file to the Zwiener Martino Milling Center ECO through our portal. What we'll get in both cases will be this. As you can see, the T-Connect has an index that allows you to find the correct position of the crown. If the index is not positioned correctly, the crown remains visibly raised. Just rotate it until the correct position in its notch is found. The bridge fits very well because the implants are quite parallel. It was very easy to achieve this position in guided surgery. If the implants are not parallel, it might not be possible to close on the neck. Working on the model is very precise as the analogs have two large repositioning faces that allow you to find their unique position within the model. For any doubt, the DWF assistance is always at your disposal at the contacts you see behind me. Do not hesitate to contact us.